back to my channel. My name is Sheila and if you are new, welcome and if you are a subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing. For today's video, I thought that I would bring you guys a thrift haul. So recently I did go thrift store shopping because I needed some clothes and my son needs some like shorts for summer um, and so I decided to go thrifting because I just loved thrifting. I always try to find um, like good quality clothes for good prices. I did go to two different thrift stores and I've talked about these um, thrift stores before. So the first one that I always like to go to, um, that one is, um, what do you call it? Like a non-profit kind of thing. It's like through a church so they don't charge taxes on anything that you buy in there. So that is the first one that I like to go to and then there's another one that I go to that has reasonable prices. Um, so yeah, let's get started and let me show you what I got. Um, also before we get started, I'm sorry about the lighting in here. I am filming in my closet and I do have a light set up um, because my room is a mess right now and so um, I decided to film in here since my closet is sort of clean <laughs> so um, yeah I did have uh, do have a little light up there and so hopefully the lighting won't be too too bad so let's go ahead and I don't know which one I guess I can show you the one that doesn't charge me tax so um, the first thing that I picked up for my son were these Vans shorts so these are some khaki shorts they're very good um i guess you can say like they're still kind of sort of new these were priced for four dollars so i got him these pairs i also found him these khaki shorts right here so these were priced at four dollars and you will see, I'm not, I'm not sure if it can focus, but you will see different tags or color tags. And that just means that sometimes um, different tags have different discounts. So this day, the tags do not apply. So I did have to pay that price. But I like these because you can actually get these wet. These are from the brand, I don't know what brand this is, but um, these you can go fishing in. Oh, this is the... Magellan Outdoors fish gear and he's a size 10 so these are good for fishing um, You guys know that my husband has like a fishing boat. So sometimes we go fishing with him So got him those and those were also four dollars. I found him this champion shirt that is still um, Kind of new and this one was priced at four dollars. So I found him this shirt He is size medium right now because he does wear size 10, 12. So I found him that. And then um, this is from the other thrift store. I think that is it for that thrift store. And then the second one, which I do have to pay tax on, I did find myself some shirts because I need like some more shirts for like summer. And so I live in scrubs because of work and so um, yeah I'm needing more shirts and shorts and things like that I mainly got shirts but I found this one which I thought was super cute um, they this one was priced at $4.99 I'm not sure if you can tell but this one was $4.99 I thought it was super cute for summertime. It hits me right like at the waist. And so at this thrift store, they do have changing rooms where you can try on your clothes. So I was able to try um, most of these stuff and it fit perfect. So um, and so I tried them on. So they're inside out. And so let me fix that real quick. So I also found this um, shirt. And I am a size small, extra small and small depending on the shirt. This is a size small. This is actually a sleeveless um, turtleneck that I thought was really, really cute. And this one was priced at $4.99. So usually with shirts that are a little bit longer, I like to tuck it in and wear like a belt because I like wearing 
high-waisted jeans for the most part um, and so I like to tuck in my shirt and wear like a nice belt and so some of these shirts I do plan on tucking in because they might be like a little bit long for me um, the next one that I found was this cute little white one it's also inside out because I tried it on and I'm so glad that I was able to try these on because I also tried on some other stuff that did not fit and so that spared me from like buying it and then having to return it so the next one that I got was this shirt right here it's a little like dressy shirt which I thought was super cute um, this one is size small and this one was priced at $6.99 so I thought that was a good deal for this cute flowy top. And so I also went to um, TJ Maxx and I did not have any luck finding like any cute things at TJ Maxx, which I know is kind of hard to believe. But um, especially for Easter, I was looking for a nice like Easter dress like um, like two weeks ago. I didn't find anything cute there so that's why I was like you know what let me go thrifting and see what I can find the next shirt that I found was this one this one I am definitely going to be tucking in because it is too long but thankfully it's like a thin material it does have like polka dots um, you can barely see them and I love this color green um, and so yeah this one um, I tried it on fit perfectly and so I like the color green. Actually, the um, uh, green is also one of my favorite colors to wear because I just think it just goes well with my skin tone. Um, this one was actually $3.99. So not bad for this um, shirt right here. So I found that one. And then I also found a shirt for work. It has our... Um, I guess university hospital logo and so I don't want to show it because then you know where I work but yeah it's a like a brand new shirt I guess I can show you well well anyways it's like a brand new shirt that's really super cute it has some bling on it for when we can wear um, usually when it's like college football time we can wear um, any college football shirt on Friday so that's why I got it and then I found these shoes or the slipper shoes which I thought were super cute and they're basically brand new I don't know what brand they are um, it doesn't say but these were $6.99 so for $6.99 not too too bad and they're like brand new I don't know if you can see but they are brand new and so these are the only shoes that I picked up because they um didn't have any luck finding any shoes so yeah for $6.99 and I do wear six and a half so these are six and a half and so I plan on wearing these they, these actually match most of the shirts actually I could I, I could actually wear these with like some jeans and the shoes and I'll be like good to go um and then I found my husband oh these actually were from the other thrift store I forgot where you don't like pay taxes so these are for my husband these are just for work these are some cargo shorts that I found him and these were five dollars so um, he works in construction so he um, is summertime or it's getting to be summertime and so he needs some more work clothes so I just buy his work clothes at the thrift store so I found him these for five dollars I also found him these so these um, I think these are from the Walmart brand polo I think Walmart has polo brands now um, and these were also five dollars so again he needs some shorts for work so nothing to he doesn't wear like anything fancy for work but still you know he still needs to look decent you know what I mean um, and then I found my youngest some more shorts so these are from the brand Sonoma. Is that Target brand? I'm not sure. I don't think it's a Walmart brand. Um, but these are 10, 12, and these were four dollars. So I found him these um, cargo shorts that he can wear for the summertime. And these are all. I forgot I had this bag, but these are all um, clothes that I got at the that thrift store where I don't have to pay taxes so I had my bags mixed up so 
Um, anyways, I found him some more cargo shorts. Um, these are from Old Navy. Still super, I guess they don't have any stains. Still looks kind of new. These were $4. So I thought that was a good deal on all these cargo shorts that I found him and then for myself I found this shirt I had to try these on at home because that thrift store doesn't have any fitting rooms and then like if you um they actually don't return your money if you return the item they just give you credit so I had to try these on at home and so I found this top which is kind of like a flowy, comfortable top. This is from, actually this is like the Walmart brand, size small. And um, this one was $5. I thought that this would look just cute with some shorts. Um, a little bit like tucked in and flowy, you know what I mean? So I like that for $4. And then I got this romper i had to um unbutton it so that way i could get it to fit but this is extra small and this is a pants romper that i found so this is what it looks like and it does have like the strings so that you can tie it in the back and it's like got the flowy pants and so yeah i thought this was super cute and this was priced at six dollars so six dollars for this cute little summertime romper that i can wear with some wedges or just some flats and i thought that was super cute i also found this one um and this was um extra small and i tried it on and it also fit it also has the flowy pant leg and it looks like this it does have these um, strings right here that you can wrap around and um, tie it, which I thought was super cute. And this one was priced at also $6, which I thought was not too, too bad. And so I found that one. And I don't really like to wear... I like to wear rompers, but it depends on how they fit. Like if they're too... Um, I don't know. I just have to try them on because not all of them like fit right so and then um i found this white flowy top which i thought was super cute this was size small i believe yeah small and i actually like this little detail right here um and this one was priced at five dollars so tried it on i like the way it fits and so bought that one and then i found this one i thought this one was a little bit loose but then i tried it on with some jeans tucked it in and it looked fine this is also like a white just plain like tank top i like how it's like a higher neck i like that and so yeah i thought this was super cute it has like some embroidered some like flower type leaves type detail i'm not sure if you can see but yeah, I, I really like this one and um, doesn't have any stains or doesn't look washed out or anything. And this one was $5. So I found that. And then um, I also found this shirt for my son. Um, it's just an Adidas shirt. Still in very good condition. Um, it's not like faded. The color's not faded or anything. Looks a little bit brand new and it was $4. So thought um, that one was cute for him to have like more shirts for the summer. And then I found two purses. Um, the first one that I found was this tote bag and this is from vera bradley i'm not sure if you can see put it up close let me put the focus thing on here this is a vera bradley tote bag that i found for 9.99 so let me see if i can put it closer i might take a picture and add it um but it was like let's see I'm putting it where the focus is so it was $9.99 and you guys know I love purses and wallets and so yeah I found this one for $10 and I don't think they realize that Vera Bradley can be a little bit expensive because I actually looked this up on 
um, Google, like the Google image. And I found one that was on Poshmark for a hundred and something. I don't remember how much. But the inside is still like brand new basically. So this is what the inside looks like. Um, so yeah, I mean I can use this for work. And if this is super cute, it's still like brand new. And so I don't think the people at the thrift store knew that this was like like a good bag because usually they if they know something is like because they also had a fossil um kind of like um like a work bag that was leather. It was so so pretty and I kind of regret not getting it. Um it has um like lots of pockets and stuff and it was just a, like a leather fossil bag um it was it looked gently used i'm not gonna lie but they did price it at 24.99 so they knew that fossil was like a good brand so they upped the price on that one and so but sometimes i don't think they realize um what some of these um purses like the brands of some of these purses because i also found this coach bag um and this is what it looks like it's like a strap-on um coach bag i might film it like standing up and so yeah i found this one and you won't believe how much this one was but before i show you how much it was i'm gonna show you how big it actually is because i don't think you realize like how much room this has but yeah this is still this is like a nice coach bag and i didn't um realized like how big it was until like i opened it but it has this section right here it has a zipper in here and i'm gonna show you where it says um coach so this is um this is a coach bag and the inside has the coach lining and so yeah it has um this section right here you can put some pins in here i'm thinking about using to start using this one and have my planner and my you guys know i have my um happy planner so i'm thinking i'm gonna use this section for my happy happy planner and putting my pins in here um and then it has this middle section where i can put my wallet it also has a zipper in this section right here and um yeah this has the middle compartment and then it has a third compartment and this one has a small little um pocket in here i don't know what you can fit in here maybe your um hand sanitizer can fit in this um or your lip gloss um for like your makeup but yeah this i was so excited to find because i just there's just lots of room in here and you can wear it as a crossbody and so you guys won't believe how much i paid for this so i paid um six dollars and 99 cents for this bag um and let me show you let me see if i can get it to focus so six ninety nine dollars for this crossbody bag this was like my favorite purchase of the day i'm not gonna lie i got super excited when i found this and this is the bag that I am going to start wearing it. I do want to put it in the washing machine in the gentle cycle. So, I don't know. Or maybe I'll just get like a wipe and kind of like wipe it down. Because, um, yeah. And it has been, I think it has been used just because the little strap, um, it doesn't look worn out or anything. But, I mean, you can tell like someone actually used this bag. I mean, but the actual bag bag there's nothing wrong with it but this um strap maybe they did put it like in the washing machine but i don't care i'm gonna use it anyways because i thought this was a super super cute and um last thing that i wanted to show you guys was like some home stuff that i bought for the bathroom so i did use my house um sinking fund for this and so i just thought i had it so i was like you know what let me just go ahead and show it so i did go to when I went to TJ Maxx, so I actually went, I told you guys, I went to TJ Maxx to like buy clothes and all that because I had set some money aside for my birthday and I didn't find any clothes stuff, but I did have my home um, sinking fund with me. So I went ahead and bought some things that I needed for the bathroom. So I needed a new mats. 
so i bought these these are a pair of two and these were 19.99 so i just got this and then i bought new a new shower curtain and a shower liner and that's basically what i got so i just um got the plastic shower liner this was 6.99 i was trying to find one that was 4.99 because usually they have some for like 4.99 um didn't find one and then i went with this um shower curtain i thought this was super pretty um i know it's white um but um yeah i like this one it's botanical wisp I don't know i just like the flowers and very like spring summer and so i picked this up and this was was 16 and 99 so i do still have some money left over in my home sinking fund and i am thinking i need to get a new bed comforter for um our bed and then one for bryson so i'm going to be setting some money aside for that too so that is it for this super quick thrift store haul i hope that you enjoyed it i was trying to go kind of fast because um usually my battery after like 30 minutes it kind of dies on me so i'm trying for that not to happen so that's why i kind of went through everything really quickly but yeah that is going to be it for today's video i hope that you enjoyed it let me know if you like these types of videos because i want to continue doing more house things um more hauls more beauty things um monthly favorites maybe things like that including my budgeting um, my cash stuffing and all of that so let me know if you are interested in that but yeah that is going to be it for today's video i hope that you had fun watching this um again if you are new to my channel and you like these types of things then don't forget to subscribe down below give this video a thumbs up and hopefully i will see you guys in my next one Bye.